Okay, science. Let's talk science. Gosh, we have so many science books. I have just a few of them right here. This is What's Science All About? What's Science All About? And this is a great reference book to have. It goes through, it's actually a combined volume of biology, chemistry, and physics. And it covers everything that your kids are going to go through in high school, junior high, and even some in elementary school, and a little bit of collegiate information too. That's a great reference book to have on hand. The solar system is part of our um, young reading series. Has the glossary in the back. But this is something that six and seven year olds could read. Um, that's also the same as the Your Body book. That's part of that same series. You take a look at that in there. And then we have a sticker book. This would be good for, I would say, all the grades really. But it, there's some of the stickers. And you can see how they're kind of grayed out and then you put the stickers on top. Then we have our Usborne Science Encyclopedia. This has 1,000 recommended websites that are constantly monitored and updated. And this goes over everything that you will ever learn in science. This is like a complete encyclopedia for science. This is a really good one. This is a good one to keep in your bathroom so your kids can constantly read. This is one of the big books. This is a big book of stars and planets. They open up with really big foldouts. I can't even get the whole thing in there when I open it up. We have an introduction to genes and DNA. Give you an idea of what that looks like on the inside right there. Then we have the See Inside Your Body book. This has over 50 flaps. Um, this, this is my son's favorite one. It has the poop. This book, I feel like, is good for all the grades. It's just more continuing education. Another See Inside book is See Inside How Things Work. Inside the concrete mixer. Anyway, we have a lot of nonfiction and science reference books. I encourage you to check them out. 